Hey everybody, I'm Anthony from ComicsEatingUp.net. I'm doing Anthony's Pickups for August 5th, 2020. Now this is a combination of spec books I picked up for sale, as well as some uh, readers. So this week was just a crazy heavy spec week. Um, so there's a ton of books that I picked up for the flip. So let's start off with the readers that I got. First up is one of my new favorite books from Aftershock. It's Disasters Incorporated uh, number two. The first issue was pretty cool. I know there was a Peach Momoko store variant that had an error on it that kind of blew up but overall this has been a really good read and a pretty interesting premise the next book is teether number four now teether has been one of my favorite horror stories this has come out of uh, antarctic press it's been a really good surprise hit we actually did a, a store variant for number one um, early on but love the book black cat number 12 has the first cover appearance of uh, black cat's iron suit uh, she's the iron cat on here of course um, she first appeared in issue 11 in a cameo but this is the first full appearance of the armor as well as uh, the first cover appearance white ash is another one of my favorite books this is a scout comic issue five is out this is actually the variant i picked up love the book it's pretty interesting it's kind of a fantasy story um, set in modern times in a, in a small town called white ash if you haven't had a chance to check it out definitely do so alien the original screenplay as a fan of the aliens franchise and movies i could not pass this up this is the original screenplay as it was originally presented and i'm interested to see the differences between the original screenplay and how it appeared on the screen my final reader comic is the goddamn virgin brides number two jason aaron's back with goddamn the first series was pretty cool i had to check out the second series and the first issue in this uh, new series was really good if you I haven't had a chance to check it out please do so it's a great read jason aaron definitely nails this kind of medieval world where the gods interact with the people and it's just it's really brutal it's really gritty and really visceral and well worth the read these are the spec books or flips that i picked up and i had a really good week this week there was a lot of great books coming out and i just couldn't wait to get my hands on it now this is something that i found on the shelves while i was looking around uh, something is killing the children number three this is the regular cover i picked up two of the foc variants uh, like last week or so the early issues of something is killing the children's really selling well ice cream man number 20 this is the b cover i got two copies of this this is that great dr seuss um, homage cover uh, these are selling for 20 25 bucks so you know <laughs> i had to grab a couple of them just because i actually pre-ordered them so i was happy to get them thor has been doing really well the black winter has kind of reinvigorated the thor franchise donny cates has been doing such a good job that these books are going back for multiple printings so i picked up a couple of copies of thor number four second printing i still have some copies of thor number four first printing that i found on the shelves so i had to pick up these these reprints have been doing really well the second printings and later usually have a smaller print run than the original ones so sometimes they can heat up so anything like i said donny cates and anything reprint um, has been doing exceptionally well so i also picked up two copies of thor number three the third print this is the nick klein character variant it's just got you know his design for thor on it really uh been doing well with thor reprints i've sold the heck out of them so i picked up two copies of this one as well this book kind of creeped under everybody's radar it's wonder woman number 759 this is the first appearance of liar liar these are doing pretty well they're going between 10 and 15 bucks so i saw some on the shelves and decided to grab a couple of copies this one was a surprise to see on the shelf people actually moved this one out of the way to find the books beneath it it's uh, venom number 25 it's still a 20 25 dollar book the big book of the week is obviously death metal legends of the dark knight number one these are going for 20 25 bucks i picked up four copies i had um, pre-ordered some and i still have some coming in the mail so i'm fully flipping these also grab the one in 25 variant i got this uh, on pre-order for 25 bucks so my buy-in was exceptionally low on this these are going for around 200 dollars currently so overall it has been a great week for me uh, for flips and as well as reads so that's it guys thanks for watching uh, if you haven't done so please like the channel and give this video a thumbs up we'll see you soon